I'm Johnny Massacre and a very sad news today. My hamster bogey passed away in my hand about an hour ago. He was fine last week, took him to the vet. Vet said everything was fine. Yesterday he was fine. Today he was a bit slow when I looked at him in the morning. He did a massive yawn, which is not normal. It was very cute. And he walked around a bit, was falling asleep, just walking around. And I thought, God, he's tired. Let him sleep all day. I was watching him, checking him like every hour, waiting for him to wake up. And when I finally heard him walking around, went to see my best friend, took him out. And he was just really, really slow, really lethargic, not able to really walk properly. And he just would get slower and slower. And sometimes he'd kind of wake up and move around. He had still had the instinct and he'd go on my arm and try to crawl up here. But something wasn't right. I looked online, there's a thing where they go into semi-hibernation called torpor, but if you make them warm, they wake up, and I was hoping it was that. It was about three in the morning, no vet was open. I just tried to nurture him, make him warm, tried to give him some water, tried to give him some food, but in the end, he just passed away in my hands, and now he's in the great big warm hamster field in the sky with as many sunflower seeds and mealworms as he can munch. It's his favorite food, the mealworm. They're just amazing creatures. They say we don't deserve dogs. We don't deserve hamsters. They're very responsive. If you put your finger in the cage, they'll come over to it. They want to play with you. They'll ju- they'll walk all over you. They'll lick your, lick your fingers and hands. They'll dab their tongue all over it. They know you're a life force. If they don't like someone, they'll bite them immediately. So they're, they're actually more intelligent than people realize. Always made me so happy. The sound of him running around on his wheel at night, even though it kept me awake, made me happy. I used to cry just thinking about him leaving me. Um... And I used to sing a song to him and I used to used to cry at the end of the song because I used to imagine him leaving because I know he's going to leave me one day and unfortunately he has too soon, only about a year old. That's uncharacteristically young for a hamster. I have no idea why it was. He's just, he's still perfect. He's still absolutely perfect. He's so gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful animal. I'm going to miss you so fucking much. You gave me great responsibility. You're like a your family to me. You're always so kind to me and always wrapped your little fingers around my legs and dabbing your tongue on my hand and made me so happy to just listen to the sound of you crunching your food and knowing that you were okay and just I love making music but I was careful not to play it too loud for you. Just wanted to keep you happy and I just wish you were still here. I've got a mountain of food over there. I bought so much bags and it would take 10 years to get through. That's how long I wanted you to live, mate. Well, I wanted you to live forever. I hope it... He was a fighter. I could see him fighting right until the end. I was trying to make it better for him, but it kind of overwhelmed him at the end. So I just want to sing my song that I always sing for him. And he he used to love it. He used to know that I was singing, I'm telling you. And he used to kind of calm down when I used to sing it to him you are my bogey my only bogey you make me happy when skies are gray if you knew just how much I loved you please don't take my bogey away I love you bogey gonna miss you they all loved you on YouTube so your amazing spirit your amazing energy it's in me now you influence me so much and I'm gonna be able to give that to other people you really really are evidence of a divine creator only God could make a coat so fluffy and perfect but you are the most perfect of perfect bogey. I love you. I miss you. Call him bogey because he looked like a golf ball, perfectly round. See you on that great golf course in the sky, my friend. I love you. Rest in peace, bogey. We will see you on the next one.